<sighs> okay, that was a good rest. I gotta get going, but I do not want to go alone again, so Niner, why don't you come with me? Okay, I'm gonna take a hit, then we'll go get some drinks, yeah? Hey, you better have some for me. Always got some for you, Six. Always. Ah, oh yeah. Okay, let's hit the Ultralux. Classiest place in town. Well, thanks, but, uh... I have no idea what you're talking about, but whatever. Maybe when we get around to it. Hey there. Alright, let's just slide this back. Oh, hey, Handy! Oh, oh, oh! Yes, mistress? Why don't you come with me? It would be my pleasure, mistress. Alright, thank ow, ow, you. Ow, ow, my finger. Ow. <laughs> Jeez, Niner, be careful. Okay, Lunette wasn't in the house, so I guess I'll check the saloon or something for her. I wanted to bring her along. We have to get that bonding done. Hey there. Alright. Oh, hey, Lunette, there you are. Seems like I'm not the only doctor here. Well, I mean, yeah. <laughs> Come on, let's hit the road. Right behind you. Hey, can I ask you a personal question? Uh, sure. Ask away. What's your favorite color? Oh, it's purple. All right. Why are you asking? Oh, don't mind me. Just curious. Okay, then. Well... I'm hungry. You're at the saloon. I'm sure they have food. Why don't you fix up your hair? Oh, yeah. I'm tired of looking at it. Yeah, why don't you curl it up a bit? Okay. Do I look good? Yeah, that looks a lot better. Let's get going. Fascinating. All right, I am sick of Prim and all that entire fucking area. So why don't we try going east, see if we can swing around to Vegas that way. It's a more direct route. I've heard there's a town called Sloan we can pass through. Oof, be careful. Geckos everywhere. Oh, right. Frankie had that house for sale. Um, would you take a photo of me, please? In here? Sure. How's my hair? Oh, never mind. It's great. You fixed it before we left, take remember? Yeah, pose inside the ammo store. Nice. Thanks a lot. No problem. You're welcome. Uh, hey, Frankie. Hello, and welcome to Frankie's Guns and Ammo. I have the caps for that house. Wow, nice work. Here's your key. New pad is right next to Doc Mitchell's house. I hope you like it. Oh, thanks. It'll be nice to be next to the Doc. <laughs> Let's go. Hope to see you again soon. Ah, uh -huh, you too. Hi. 
I've got something for you. Oh, thanks. Catch! Thanks. I know we already got a house, but there's so many people. We definitely need more room. It'll come Look, in this handy. This dust gets into everything. Yeah, it's the Mojave. What do you expect? All right, let's go. Oh yeah, sorry about your bike, Niner. Would have made it easier to get around, too. But the good thing is when you're walking, you find adventures and stuff. Not always good, but still. Oh yeah, we can get to Vegas that way. Be on the lookout for powder gangers. They might remember me. Ugh. Never want to go there again. Oh shit! They're fighting people. Oh no! Won't somebody help them? Let's rock! <sighs> Come on. Looks like some raiders. And some mercenaries? Oh, shit. Oh, come on. Damn it. Ooh, okay. Ooh, thanks, Dag. At least if they were left, that means they must have killed all the powder gangers here. Yep, looks like it. Fredericks, too. Good riddance. Ah, they killed Escobar. That's great. Well, definitely not going to cry over these guys. Come on, let's go. Ah, shit. More raiders. Uh. Fucking hell. Come on. Okay. Whew, we're okay. Just need to get to Sloan. I think some raiders must have moved in and taken advantage of the powder ganger situation. Oh, this car is actually intact. Always good to find some drugs and explosives.
All right. Huh. What's who's that? Looks like they're killed under this bridge. Haven't seen a rope like that before. Wonder where they're from. Come on. Oh, there it is. There's Sloane. This must be a shortcut to Vegas. Hold up. There are death claws all over the damn place north of here. I'd turn back if I were you. If you want to get to New Vegas, you're better off heading east from Prim and then looping north. It's a heck of a lot safer. Not as safe as you'd think. Where'd the death claws come from? They moved into the quarry after the powder gangers came through and made off with most of our dynamite. We shut the quarry down while we waited for the NCR to get us some more blasting sticks, but now the death claws have shown up. The NCR is a no show, and my men and I have got nothing to do but sit on our asses all day. It's damn frustrating. Oh, uh, well, I. Have you had problems with death claws before? Uh, we'd see them occasionally, but they didn't seem too keen on getting too close to the quarry. Not sure if it was the noise or all the workers. I can't believe that an entire pack moved into the quarry. I thought that kind of bad luck only happened in New Vegas. Well, I could take care of the death claws for you. I don't know what it is about you, but I think you could actually pull it off. Death claws are tough bastards, but you might be even tougher. Nobody here is any use to you in a fight against death claws, but take these medical supplies. You'll probably need them. To do the job right, you've got to get rid of the pack leaders, the mother death claw and the death claw alpha male. Should run the rest of them off. Uh, thanks. Yeah, wouldn't be the first time I've taken out a pack of them, but uh, we'll see how bad it is. What do you know about the Powder Gangers? They're a bunch of escaped cons from down south. The NCR was using them to maintain the railways as part of their sentence. I don't know who screwed up, but the Powder Gangers are loose. It was one group that attacked us and took our entire supply of dynamite. That must be how they kept supplied even after the riot. Let's talk about something else. Okay. What is this place? This is Sloan, a camp for us quarry workers. The actual quarry, Quarry Junction, is up the road north of here. The whole thing is an NCR operation. We make cement for the NCR using the limestone we dig out with dynamite and drag lines. Dirty work, but the pay's good. Wish we got paid in caps, though. Not a lot of merchants like taking NCR paper money. Oh, so this is like a frontier town. What does the NCR need with the cement? It all gets shipped by rail over towards Boulder City and Hoover Dam. The NCR is probably building fortifications with it all. Oh, the war effort. What's a drag line? It's a big machine which moves rocks around, piles at a time. It's pre-war tech, so you need to thump it once in a while to keep it running. Oh, that's really cool. Well, my body's pre-war tech, too, so you got to thump it a few times to keep it working. <laughs> um, you don't get paid in caps, though? Nope. The NCR has been trying to switch over to using paper money, just like in the pre-war days. Trouble is that the exchange rates ain't exactly fair. For example... A hundred bucks in NCR money is valued at roughly half that in caps around here. Seems like a rotten deal for us, but work is work. That's interesting. You'd think it'd be more stable currency than caps, which are used all across the wasteland. Does New Vegas deal in caps? That would explain why it's more stable around here. Let's talk about something else. Sure. What can you tell me about New Vegas? I've been there once, and I don't recommend it. 
It's just a way to burn through a month's pay in five minutes. I've seen a lot of folks come through here thinking they'll have the easy life once they get there. It never happens. Oh, really? Huh, sad. All right, bye. If you insist on going north, don't be expecting a rescue when you get into trouble. I can handle myself. But thank you. should, um, get naked? You know, so we don't... Hey. Hey, sex? <laughs> uh, not a, actually a smart suggestion, Niner. You'll probably just get burned. Try to measure my charisma on a vitomatic vigor... Hey. Let me ask you a question. What's the tastiest thing you've ever eaten? Um, anything that wasn't made 200 years ago? Ah, uh, yeah. Can you believe some people still eat that stuff? Anyway, I've got this recipe for a Deathclaw omelet that I've been itching to try out. Trouble is, I need a Deathclaw egg. Kind of obvious, I suppose. Oh, shit. Uh, where did you come up with this recipe? My great-aunt Rose ran a bed and breakfast back in California, in a town called Modoc. She's the one who created the recipe in the first place. I don't know how she managed to get a hold of a female deathclaw, but she kept it in a shed. Aunt Rose had a steady supply of eggs for her omelets. At least, she did until some stranger came along and killed the deathclaw, shot it right in the eye. Oof. Uh, where can I find a deathclaw egg? The quarry just north of here is full of death claws, so there's bound to be an egg or two in there somewhere. Of course, a death claw egg from anywhere will do. According to my Aunt Rose, those things have a ridiculously long shelf life. Well, that's pretty dangerous to get an egg from a death claw. What are you offering in exchange? I don't have much in the way of money, but I'd be willing to share the secret of the recipe. Ooh, okay, that's actually tempting. All right. Do you need anything to eat or drink? Oh, uh, what have you got? Sure thing. I'll take a Brahmin steak. Thanks. Could I ask you some questions about this place? Sure. What did you want to know? Well, you don't look like a quarry worker. Oh, I'm not. I'm making my way to New Vegas. They say anything goes there. And best of all, the NCR can't mess it up for you. I'll get there eventually. <clears throat> I've heard that you can't even get into the strip unless you're rich. Oh, shit, really? Huh. Wonder how they gatekeep that. Are you from California? Born and raised. Things back in California are better than they've ever been, according to my grandpa. The raiders are mostly gone now, and it's easy enough to get a job at one of the mills or farms. But now there's taxes and laws and other things. The NCR keeps things safe and orderly, but it's all very boring. So, I came out east, towards the frontier. Well, is there any trouble around here to make it exciting? Well, there's the Death Claws, of course. And there was that one group of powder gangers who stole all the dynamite. I think we're too small and poor for anyone to bother with, really. I keep a weapon near my bunk, though. Same as everybody here. That's a good idea. Uh, stay safe, and I'll be back with the death claw egg eventually. All right. Do you need anything to eat or drink? I'm good. Bye. All right, then. Okay, uh, oh, hi. Let's see who else is around town. The Death Claws have been keeping their distance, for now. Well, I hope they stay away from you guys. Hello. Jazz screwed up the coffee again. Wouldn't drink it if I were you. I'll keep that in mind. Ooh, that is unique. Uh, 
Okay. Oh, damn. <sighs> so it's that. It's too damn hot. Okay. Oh, hi, little buddy. Who are you? Oh, are you hurt? Your leg looks hurt. Are you okay? How's it going? Oh, yeah, your leg looks hurt. Here, I can take care of it for you. There you go. Be a good boy. All right. It should heal up, okay? Oh, hi. Hey, welcome. I'm Dwayne. You look like someone who's good at getting stuff done. I could use some help with something. Oh, what do you need help with? Well, you see, there's not too much to do around here, so us workers keep a stash of booze just so we can have some fun once in a while. Thing is, I need someone to go and find it. Oh, where is it? It's in the quarry. The quarry full of death claws. Yes, that one. We left it in there before the death claws showed up so Chomps wouldn't find it and confiscate it. Seemed like a good idea. Okay, I'll try and find it. You are a hero. You should find it at the top of the crusher, the big tower in the middle of the quarry. Try not to get, you know, eaten. Sure. I'll try to be careful. Hello again. What do you do here? Well, I work here, mining rocks and stuff. Not much else to tell. Okay, well, where are you from? California, Shady Sands to be exact. I came out here for work. Didn't want to end up here, but it's something, right? I mean, yeah, sure. Uh, I'll go see if I can find that booze. See you later. Bye. Hi. Our guys put the monorail back to work. Ooh, interesting. This is plans for a death claw gauntlet. At a workbench, combine wonder glue, leather belt, medical brace, death claw hand. With this weapon, your unarmed attacks will have the ferocity and armor shredding power of death claws, assuming you can survive long enough to take one of their hands, of course. Well, this seems to be a favored weapon across the wasteland. Careful. Guys always get in everyone's way. Huh. Doesn't look like there's anyone here. Ooh, one of those games. And this looks like an interesting weapon. Hey, six, can we stop off somewhere? I need to buy some ammo. We and, were uh, at the ammo shop earlier. Some cigarettes. Something to play with. Maybe a belt with a skull in it. That'll look good. There's cigarettes over there in that suitcase, okay? And Luna, don't look at me like that. It was a BB gun in the common area. I think it's fine for me to take. At the very least, it's in exchange for me helping them fight Death Claws. <sighs> All right, let's go. Okay, let's go check out the quarry. Oh, huh, what's this building? Ah, uh, it's locked up tight. Oh, hi. I hope they don't close the quarry. I need the money. Well, I'm glad to see there's some super mutants in the NCR. Generator's still not working. Big surprise. 
Uh, hey guys, it's really dangerous up ahead, and I can sneak around better than you all, so why don't you just stick around here, okay? This'll be nice and safe for you. Okay, they won't be able to see me coming if I'm alone. Oh shit. Oh, I think those are decoys. Yeah, they're already dead. Powderganger must have put up a fight. Oh shit, that one is huge. I think I could take him. Oh, wait, what's that glowing one? No, oh shit, they see me, they see me. Oh shit. Nope, nope. Oh shit, this is doing nothing. Oh, run away. Oh, no, no, please, no, leave me alone, please. This is such a bad call. There are so many of them. Some of them are glowing. Oh, my fucking God. I need to get further away. They're looking for me. Oh, this is Shaq. Huh. Ow. Locked up. Uh, I'll duck in here if I can get in. <sighs> okay. Oh, shit. It's a radio station, but no one's here. Oh, no. What happened? Oh. Huh. Interesting gun. Oh. If you're hearing this hollow tape, I'm dead. Neither whatever sickness is going on with me has killed me, or you killed me. If you killed me, then fuck you. If you just happen to cross this, I'm the host of New Love Radio. I, um, I started getting these blackouts and these headaches. I'm always tired. It hurts to move. I've just been laying in bed, replaying everything I had recorded. I think this is it. Anything in here is yours, including my gun. Hope it serves you well. This is New Love Radio, signing off. Oh, that's so sad. Did he have like a brain tumor or something? He is a great radio host. I haven't even listened to all the pre-recorded tracks yet. You know what? I'm going to play one right now just for you. Stupidable what I just said, ladies and gentlemen, was absolute nonsense. But, sometimes nonsense can be good. This is Louis Prima and Wolfgang Luar. Waddy Dottie. Aw, that was nice. 
I'll make sure to listen to all of them eventually so your work's not in vain.